We supply and spread crushed silica rock such as basalt on agricultural land free of charge or well subsidised. This enhances soil health while removing carbon dioxide from the atmosphere through a process called enhanced rock weathering. This mineral rich rock has been applied to the soil for hundreds of years and the benefits noted are improved soil fertility and improved soil biology which has improved crop yield and crop health and vitality. Our basalt can be applied to all crops including pasture and it's approved for use on organic farming systems. The crushed silicate rocks that we spread on the fields release a whole range of nutrients. These can reduce the requirement for the farmer to apply so much fertiliser. At the same time, it has an effect on soil pH. It will slowly increase the pH, or at least it will help maintain the pH at the target that the farmer is trying to achieve. This can reduce the requirement for the farmer to lime or to lime less frequently. We're conducting trials on eight different crops, from grassland to oats to barley to wheat to oilseed rape, even on potatoes. So far we've collected almost 1,200 samples of soil and crop tissue, with thousands more on the horizon. First thing we do is dry the samples, and then we can sieve them, then we can measure the pH, and more importantly we can archive the samples, because once the soil has been dried, these parameters like soil pH, nutrient contents are all stable. I'm Murray Cooper, farm here at Mains Thornton near Inverurie. We're an organic farm with about 160 cows, 950 sheep and we grow seed crops, seed barley, seed oats. We also grow oil seed rape for crushing for organic cold pressed oils. At New Milne Farm we sell food to people and a lot of our customers are very interested in their health and that goes right back in steps to the soil. We need soil that's full of nutrients, we need a diversity of plants and then we get meat that's packed full of goodness. We first used the rock dust back in 2014. The fields that spread on are greener than the fields that did not get spread. And in May of this year, we took delivery of around 2,000 tonnes of basalt rock dust. We have just done the results this morning. <laughs> there was a five bales a hectare difference, 18.3 bales to the hectare in the spread area and 13.3 bales to the hectare in the unspread area. This week, Undo are spreading 3,000 tonnes of rock dust onto 150 hectares. That's basically all the grassland. I've been hearing about its benefits for probably 20 years. The effects it had on, on improving soils and that then fed through to, to yields. I had a one time investigated the spreading it myself. I was put off by the cost, I must confess. And then I was walking around the Highland Show this year and I saw an Undo stand and they offered to spread it for free. Margins are under pressure in farming. Getting something that improves our output for free is a huge bonus. So I definitely recommend it. It's doing something good for the environment and I'm benefiting it from it, hopefully long term. Not having to apply lime, getting a yield increase, hopefully reducing my use of artificial minerals as well to feed the livestock. Carbon removal is a nice extra for us. We're very much focused on improving our soils and if we can get more carbon in there, it's good for us and good for the environment. So it's a win-win for everyone.